According to scientists, fish are the very first inhabitants of our planet. Due to their adaptability to existence in the water, they were able to survive all the big and small disasters on Earth. People are interested in fish for two reasons, gastronomic and aesthetic. From the gastronomic side, everything is clear, I caught it and ate it. But the aesthetic side continued its development in the form of creating home aquariums. Every year the popularity of such aqua systems increases, and the imagination of people in the design of the internal space of the reservoir has no boundaries. To fill the aquarium, fish of all kinds, plants, stones, various decorative elements, as well as the base, soil, consisting of different materials, stones, fine gravel, expanded clay, sand are used. This video will consider such an aquarium ground laying as quartz sand. Quartz is a fairly common natural mineral of white color, mined from the Earth's crust. After the procedure of extraction from the ground and washing, it is broken down into fractions of various sizes, from small 0.1 mm to large, over 5 mm. Quartz sand differs from ordinary sand in its uniform composition, better susceptibility to dirt, more pleasant appearance and other positive characteristics, which will be described below. Color and size of quartz sand Such sand comes in several sizes, dusty, 0.1 mm, fine-grained, 0.25 mm, medium-grained, up to 0.5 mm, and coarse-grained, 3 mm. The color varies from pure white to black, which is considered rare and therefore the most expensive type of quartz sand. Its other name is Morian. It contains aluminum impurities and looks very impressive in the aquarium. When choosing the color of quartz, it is necessary to take into account the color of the fish, the lighter and more transparent they are, the darker the soil should be. You can also use colored sand, but you should make sure that the painting is of high quality and will not harm underwater inhabitants and plants. Pros of using quartz sand Pleasant appearance and rich color palette Does not release methane and ammonia into the water, as happens when using river sand. Produces carbon dioxide, necessary for the respiration of fish and plants. Quartz soil does not sour, remains clean and fresh for a long period of time. The roots of plants are well kept in such soil. Sand is neutral to various water compositions. Good circulation of water between the quartz particles is ensured. Sand does not change the chemical composition of water. Real quartz does not absorb heat well, so the aquarium will always have a comfortable cool temperature. Black quartz, in which magnetite particles are present, does not stain the water and, against the backdrop of light fish and plants, provides a special aesthetic pleasure with its spectacular decor. Cons of using quartz sand The sand contains small fractions that can cloud the water and precipitate. Such sand is not recommended for aquariums with fish burrowing into the ground, eels, rays, as the sharp edges of the fractions can injure them. Sand does not contain enough minerals for underwater plants, so additional feeding is necessary for their growth. Quartz sand is very easy to fake, passing off a technical grade as genuine. Therefore, when buying such sand, you need to be very careful not to be a victim of unscrupulous sellers. How not to make a mistake in choosing a quartz soil will be discussed in the next paragraph. How to check the authenticity of quartz sand. When buying quartz sand for an aquarium, you need to be extremely careful not to purchase crafts. The following signs indicate the authenticity of sand. When reacting with acetic acid, there are no bubbles, while the color of the sand does not change. In real sand, the presence of natural defects is mandatory, cracks, degrees of transparency. Uneven color of sand. If the color looks even and uniform, then most likely it is a fake, a technical or other crushed type of sand, colored with various chemicals. When sand particles rub against glass, scratches appear on it. How to choose the right quartz sand? For small fish, you need to choose fine sand fractions. They like to hide in the ground, eat its particles, 
and therefore the most comfortable size of soil fractions for underwater excavations will be sand 0.25 mm. Larger fish require sand containing larger constituents. Large individuals prefer to hide not in the sand, but in the thickets of underwater greenery, and fine sand can get into the gills and cause various diseases. Therefore, a fraction size of 3 to 5 mm will be the best option for them. Underwater plants thrive in coarse sand, as they promote better water circulation and root washing. Sand Preparation for Use Preparing quartz sand for use is quite feasible at home. First of all, the sand must be cleaned and disinfected. Here, a simple boil in a saucepan or calcination on a baking sheet for 20 to 30 minutes will be enough. Along with this, you also need to wash the aquarium. The treated sand is first poured into the container, and then clean, settled water is poured. As the sand becomes contaminated, which is three to four times a year, it is removed from the reservoir and again goes through the calcination procedure. An aquarium is not only a habitat for fish and plants. This is, first of all, a closed ecosphere with its own rules and procedures that require constant monitoring by the owners. And therefore, the issue of filling the aquarium must be approached correctly and not in a hurry. The whole ecology of the aquatic biosystem depends on the correct choice of soil. In order for all its inhabitants to feel comfortable, it is necessary to choose high-quality sand that guarantees a long life and health of the fish. Quartz sand is ideal in this regard. Despite some disadvantages, it has many positive aspects already discussed above. And may your goldfish fulfill all your desires. Are you thinking about getting an aquarium? Let us know what you decide in the comments below. And if you know someone who's thinking about getting an aquarium, please share this with them. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Otherwise, have a great day. Thanks for watching.